Christina, John, this was a violent crash. I'm going to show you uh, one of the vehicles. You can see that black Honda just unrecognizable here on Sierra Madre and Colorado in Pasadena. The driver in that vehicle did not survive this crash. Now, if we can swing over, the suspect vehicle is that white uh, SUV. Preliminary information from Pol Pasadena police is that this SUV was traveling southbound on Sierra Madre Boulevard when it struck the black Honda that was traveling eastbound on Colorado, pushing it over the median. The vehicle hit a fire hydrant and the driver again was pronounced dead here at the scene. This all happened around 2 a.m. The driver in the white SUV, we are told, fled the scene on foot, leaving their vehicle behind here at the scene. Now, police, of course, searching for that suspect. If you can come back to our picture here live, you can see detectives are here on scene. They've shut down a large uh, portion of this in, this uh, intersection, actually. Sierra Madre and Colorado closed off to traffic in a block each way, so no traffic allowed this way. And you can see all the debris in the middle of this intersection. Now, police say that there's several businesses around this area that have surveillance footage. They're hoping to look at that surveillance footage to shed some light on exactly what took place here and maybe give them some identifying factors on this suspect who fled the scene on foot. That person, of course, leaving behind a big piece of evidence, their vehicle here, uh, and police saying that likely this was a cause of, of speed. They will be looking into other factors, of course, like uh, drugs or alcohol, and if the suspect or the victim ran the red light. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Click the ABC7 logo to subscribe to our Eyewitness News YouTube channel.